Hi guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. I miss you guys so much. I feel like I didn't speak to you for a day and it feels like 500 years. You know that you know that feeling? For today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys a Nordstrom Rack makeup find video. So I love making these videos. I would say about once a month. There are times that I go to Nordstrom Rack and I literally find nothing. So sometimes it could be a little bit more than a month. But to the most part, on average... It's like once a month. They don't really get um, as much new things as TJ Maxx and Marshalls does. Anyways, I will go ahead and leave my previous Nordstrom Rack Finds video down below in the description box. And what really inspired this is my weekly TJ Maxx makeup find. So I'll leave that playlist down below as well. I did include some NYC footage so you guys can feel more of the vibe. Definitely let me know if you guys recently found anything exciting at Nordstrom Rack or if you were there and you're kind of like, there's nothing here. I have seen on Instagram that people did find the um, Urban Decay Game of Thrones eyeshadow palette. I was unsuccessful. Successful, but hopefully in the next few days or a week or two, I'll find that. But anyways, let's go ahead and start the video. So I see that they stacked up on these candle lit glow highlighting powders. Really cute, $12.97 each, and they're all in the same shade, which is warm. I, I used to own it in the past, but I decluttered it because I just didn't like how it looked on my skin, but the formula is really nice. If you have a medium to deep complexion, it would look beautiful. I have the one that's for fair to light skin tones. I just feel like it works better for me. Um, we saw this at TJ Maxx, but now we see it here at Nordstrom Rack. And then moving over to this section here, this is so exciting. $24.97, hopefully you guys can see there, yeah. Uh, originally $49. This is probably like old as I don't know what, but it's not a makeup product. It's actually makeup brushes. It's the Christmas Dreams Essential Cruelty Free Brush Kit. Very cute. You get one, two, three, four, five brushes as well as a really cute makeup bag that says a dream in makeup. So cute. Honestly, freaking adorable, gorgeous, beyond words. This would be so stunning to place on like your vanity to make it look like old girly and fun and just pretty. So I see that they stocked up on a ton of stuff. A lot of these are brand new. Let's get started. We have a nice amount of Laura Geller products here. We've seen all of these products at TJ Maxx, but if you can't find these products at TJ Maxx, Nordstrom Rack has it as well. So we have some of the lipsticks here, some of the glosses here, um, mascaras. I will say though that the prices at TJ Maxx are better than Nordstrom Rack, so I'll just have it in mind. I'm the most excited about this bin because this is the new Smashbox Crystallized Collection. I remember I went to Ulta about three months back. It literally just released then. I was really intrigued to pick up a few pieces but never did and now it's here at Nordstrom Rack. What? 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 I'm so excited! First up we have one of the Crystallized Covershot Eyeshadow Palettes. The packaging is stunning. G give me a second. It's so pretty. So you guys can see here, original value 29, here at Nordstrom Rack it's $14.97. How pretty, how gorgeous. I'm telling you, this is definitely a statement piece of its own. Displayed anywhere, it adds a vibe. Here you guys can see what the palette looks like on the inside. We get two, four, six, eight shades. Um, some metallic, some matte. Some of these are pretty deep, but I still feel like you'd be able to create a look for a day-to-day -day basis. Then we have some of these crystallized photo finish um, priming waters from Smashbox. So they have, I believe, three in the line, but there are only two here at Nordstrom Mac, or at least at mine. These are both full sizes, original value 32 bucks, um, but here it's $14.97 and there's 3.9 float onto the product in each. This one here is called Clary Sage Plus Tea. The packaging is really beautiful. I'll leave my uh, Ulta video down below because I remember mentioning that there was one that I enjoyed more than the others in regards to the scent. This one right here is in Jasmine Plus Rose. Also really gorgeous. I'm loving the pink packaging. And these in general are really nice to apply before you go in with your foundation. I'm in literally makeup heavenland. I don't even know what to say. These are the crystallized always on eyeshadows. I have three different shades here. Ah, retailing for only $9.97, original value, 24 bucks. 24 is a lot. So here you guys can see the shade name of the first one. This is a gorgeous pink. Um, the packaging though is everything. Like, look at the lid, it's so pretty. This would look really nice on the eyes, like as a one-stop shop situation. I feel like it'd probably be similar to the Stila Glitter and Glows. I feel like a lot of brands are doing that. But damn, for 10 bucks, this is legit. And then we have this shade right here. It's a nice bronzy type of color. The shade name is on top there on the box. Again, packaging, everything to me and more. This one right here is called Mindful AF. It's in a gorgeous blue. Look at all that glitter. Yum. This is mesmerizing. Look at this all day. All day, every day. We actually have another one that I just found. This one is called That's Fire. It's definitely more of like a bronzy, fiery type of shade. 
We have a nice amount of these Urban Decay Singular eyeshadows here. The packaging is really pretty. This is part of the Mundus line, and these are in Stellar. I think that these are $21 on Sephora and Ulta currently, and here it is, $9.97. Yeah, $22 originally, see? I don't even know anymore. Next up, I see um, they have this Urban Decay Naked Illuminated Shimmering Powder for the face and body. Original value $34, but here it's $14.97. I was never the biggest fan of these, so let me know if you guys like this. The packaging is really beautiful. It's in the shade Lit, but it is pretty bulky at the same time, so have that in mind. Here's what this looks like. I will say it's a bit deeper in tone, so if you have a medium to deep complexion, it would look really, really nice. If you're fair, I think that there is a shade that would suit you better than this one. We have even more Urban Decay jackpots chilling right over here. So firstly, I see they have these Urban Decay Naked Skin um, foundations. This used to be everything on YouTube or in the makeup world in general. So this original value was $40, now it's $19.97. I'm curious to know why they reformulated this because I know a lot of people really, really love this foundation. Anyways, there are a bunch of shades to choose from, so definitely something in this line for everyone here at Nordstrom Rack because a lot of times they'll bring in foundations and there's like one or two shades and it's not really for everyone, you know? And then also I cannot believe that they have these naked skin weightless creaseless concealers here. These literally used to be everything on YouTube. I remember I saved my money for this. It was 29 bucks. I really, really liked it, but I felt like, damn, it's a lot. Yeah, original value 29, but here it's 1447. This used to be the concealer of life. I don't know. I don't know what happened. Remember, memories are flooding back. Um, really nice. It has a doe foot applicator and it's pretty hydrating. I should say it has, I would say, medium coverage. And also with the concealers, I see they have a nice amount of shades to choose from. Light, fair, medium dark. So medium light yeah a little bit of everything and then how cool is it to see this it's the naked skin one and done blur on the run touch up finishing balm so cool they have them in various different shades here original value 34 here it is 16.97 this actually doesn't ring a bell i don't even remember when this came out but the packaging is beautiful right it's a baby tad swatch but i don't know what the consistency is like i'm assuming it's more of like a foundation consistency because it says it's a bomb but how would you use this product you know let me know if you guys try this what you think about it no. Then I'm really excited for this little bin. This is the Urban Decay Naked Flush um, Blush, Bronzer, and Highlighter Palette. So we have them in different like color stories. So this one right here, as you guys can see, is in Nooner. We also have this one in Going Native. So just know that there are a few to choose from. This one right here is in Sesso. And yes, that's pretty much it. Three of them to choose from. Original value was $34, but here it's $14.97. The outer packaging looks the same on all of them. It's a really nice, sturdy um, palette. This one right here is in Sesso. I love that raspberry matte blush. We get a really pretty opaly champagne-y highlighter and then more of a deeper bronzer. This one is in Going Native. I would say this would probably suit um, fair to light skin tones the best. It has a nice cool tone pinky blush, a pretty whitish um, highlighter, and then a tone bronzer. This one right here is in Nooner. The blush has a little specks of glitter in there. The highlighter is so pretty. I think that's my favorite one from the bunch. And then we also get more of a mid-tone bronzer. So most of the shades are pretty similar. We have a few more products here from Urban Decay. This is the Drop Shot Mix in Facial Oil. You guys know this really speaks to me. Original value 34, here it is $16.97. And here is what the oil looks like. I feel like this would be really nice to mix in with your foundation um, or would be nice to also put on prior to putting on foundation. Looks good, it has like a dropper applicator to it and I love the purple packaging. We got a liquid lipstick set here from Bare Minerals. You guys know Bare Minerals is one of my favorite liquid lipstick brands. This is the travel exclusive kit. Original value 41 bucks, but it's $24.97 here and it includes three full size liquid lipsticks. So firstly, I love that when you open up the big box, each one is um, packaged in its own individual box. So you can keep one for yourself, give some to others. I like that. I think it's it's basically like getting three for the price of one if you would purchase this at Ulta or Sephora. So here are the three shades that are included. We get Swag, Infamous, and Friendship. A Nude Lover's Life and Dream. I love this kit. I see that we have some kits here from Stila. I love, love, love the packaging of these kits. So beautiful. So, like, amazingly presented. Ugh. So the original value of this kit was 20 Here it's $12.97. I think if we would find this at TJ Maxx, it would be $9.99. So... Here it's a bit more expensive, like two, three dollars more. And then here are the three shades on the back. I think patina is one of their um, most famous shades. Then we have this Stila um, Glitter and Glow Kit. We found this at TJ Maxx. This one right here is called All Fired Up. It's actually currently sold on Sephora at the moment for 25 bucks. At TJ Maxx it was 9.99, but here at Nordstrom Rack it is 14.97. So yeah, original value 25. So like I mentioned. 
TJ is probably the cheapest, then Nordstrom, then Sephora and Ulta. Next up, we have this Bare Minerals Desert Getaway Kit. It includes a loose powder, a gloss, and then a mascara. Original value, 25. Okay, here it's 22.97. Original value, I guess, isn't correct for this specific product. What I would say it's probably not a worth a kit to pick up, uh, just based on products we find at TJ Maxx. And uh, 22.97 here, still a little bit up there. I don't know if I would recommend it. Here are the shade names for reference. I mean, it's a good kit, but I still feel like it's not that much off, you know? Then we have this Bare Minerals Treat Yourself 3-Piece All About You Kit. Original value, 30 bucks. Here it is, $22.97. So also not with this one, not that much off. And here are the three products that we're getting in this kit. I believe we're getting a full-size lip lacquer. And then the other two products are deluxe sizes. We got some MAC palettes here. I absolutely love these. I love the color stories in each palette. And I think that most of them are... Um, pretty good quality. This one right here is Raver Girl. I, would, I wouldn't call myself a Raver Girl. Maybe like five years ago, but not anymore. <laughs> I love raves. The original value of these palettes are 41 but here it's $22.97. And usually at TJ, these palettes retail for $19.99. But a lot of times you don't find these palettes there. It's very, very rare, I feel like. How gorgeous is Raver Girl? These colors so peak to me. So pretty, we get a selection of mattes and metallics, um, as per usual. And I love that there's like a rosy toned um, story going on in here. I love those kind of shades. On, honestly, any eye color, I feel like it brings out brown, blue, green, hazel eyes gorgeously. And then I really, really love the packaging of this one. This one is pretty punk. How badass is this? I need you. Retailing for $22.97 as well. God, I love the packaging. I can't get over it. I love how like, they kind of spray painted the word punk on top of punk. You know, like punk. Here's what this palette looks like. We get a selection of like purples, a green, a blue, and then some cooler tone shades. Okay, then we just have some like restocks here, some MAC products, some Urban Decay brushes that we saw last time in my um, Nordstrom Rack video. I also see that they brought these in, which we've seen at uh, TJ Maxx. So it was a $39 valued kit, but here it's $14.97. I think at TJ it was either $7.99 or $8.99. If you happen to really want it, I still think $14.97 is still a good price tag if you can't find it at TJ. Yeah, it basically includes four full-size products. I love this. I purchased mine from TJ Maxx. Original value 32. It's a dripping in gold illuminator palette. Gorgeous. $14.97 here from 32 bucks. And I want to say at TJ, uh, Emma, where are you? She knows all the prices of everything. Like, even if it's from like six years ago, I'm telling you, she's so good with these things. I don't know. I think at TJ it was maybe $8.99, $7.99, or possibly even $6.99. Then there's a whole bin here of these Laura Mercier I Art Caviar Color Inspired Edition eyeshadow palettes. We've seen other Laura Mercier um, palettes at Nordstrom Rack and um, TJ, but I do not recall seeing this. Correct me if I'm wrong. I remember because this is more warmer in tone and the other ones were cooler. But this is beautiful. Just from looking at the box. Original value of these are $55, but here $24.97, so pretty much a little bit more than half off. I'm loving this like cushiony, delicious feel. And then it's magnetic as well. And then here you guys can see what the shades look like on the inside. Very pretty. I feel like these are very soft. And we also have like a gray and black in there if you want to kind of spice things up for the night or day. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I see that we actually also have this Bare Minerals Desert Vibes kit here, which includes the Lash Domination Mascara and then the Finishing Powder. Yeah, Finishing Powder. <laughs> These, um, they're <laughs> into deluxe sizes, whoa. Original value 15 here is $11.97. Then we have three of these Bare Minerals Bare Pro Longwear Eyeshadow Sticks in three different shades. These are really pretty. I do own a few of these. It's like a one-stop shop situation. Apply, blend, go. So maybe something similar to like the Laura Mercier Caviar Sticks. Original value 20 here is $11.97. At TJ, usually these are, I want to say, $5.99. Here are the three shades we have, starting from this one right over here at the top one, I would say. That's Smoky Chai. Middle one is Midnight Violet. The bottom one is Rose Quartz. I'm at a different Nordstrom rack right now and everything here is super beyond neat. This doesn't always happen, so we've gone over those already. This we saw a few weeks back. Most of these we also saw a few weeks back, but this is brand new. So this is pretty much the only shade of the Retro Matte Liquid Lip Color that's here. Original value 22, here it's 10.97. And this is in 2 Matte with Love. And here you guys can see it's a pretty deep pinky shade. I love the lids. I always say that, but it's just it's so cute that it's the same lid as they use on their lipsticks. You know what I mean? And they have these kits in this Nordstrom rack as well, but they didn't have this one in the other place. Um, this is the Desert Romance um, Matte Liquid Lip Duo. They are in deluxe sizes. Original by 15. Here it's 11.97. The two shades we get are in Swag and in Slay. Love these kind of colors. And then I also see that there's a Bare Minerals Mask Essentials brush, which is pretty cool. Original value 18, here it is 10.97. I have to say, I do like the fact that in this Nordstrom rack, 
they have testers so you can see what shade might suit you and then you can just purchase it. And then they also have a nice amount of these Stila um, liquid liners as well as the liquid lipsticks. We've seen these many times at Promotion Rack as well as um, TJ Maxx. And then we have a ton of Stila glitter and glows. These are also a ton of shades that we've seen at TJ Maxx, um, Nordstrom Rack, like Spiritual, Mystic, Peach Pretense, Enigmatic. So the original value of all of these are 24, but here it's 9.97. At TJ and Marshalls, they're usually 8.99, but they recently, I feel like, reduced the prices, at least for some of them, um, to 6.99. We have some of the Urban Decay um, Vice lipsticks here um, in various different shades. I'll show you guys in a second. Um, original value 18, but here it's 8.97. There are many different finishes in regards to the formula, and to the most part, the few that I've tried, I really do like. We have Hawk Eye, Hawkey, I don't know. It's a metallicized finished. Exhibition Comfort Matte, then Spell Bowl, which is a cream finish. And then we have these four shades Ember, which is a metallicized finish, Backfire, metallicized, Roach is a cream, it looks like a gorgeous brown, and then Crank is a mega matte, so that might be drying on the lips. This is the Buxom Party Girl Pow um, lipstick set. I remember when this came out, I want to say, I think maybe like two, no, 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 maybe like four years ago. Uh, the lipsticks look really pretty, and then there's like, well, a little mask sticker thingy. Original value 29, but here it's 22.97 for four full-size lipsticks. Here are the shade names: Big O, Glowing, Flushed, and Fiery. And I also see that they have more of these Mundas eyeshadows here in Stargazer. Um, the one we saw earlier today in Stellar looks very similar to this, also 9.97. Here you guys can actually see the differences. The one on the left is Stargazer. The one on the right is Stellar. Wow, very similar. Damn, what, what's the difference? I love the box. I want to show you guys how gorgeous it's here at like night. It's not pitch dark outside yet, but it's getting there. Look how beautiful. It looks kind of fake because it looks so good, you know? That is pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I did not pick up anything. I'm trying to be like pretty strong because a lot of times I feel like I impulse buy. I mean, you guys know this word. I don't even have to explain myself. Um, and then also I'm spending so much at Sephora and Ulta. So I'm like, you just, there's, there's one door that just needs to be closed. And so far it's not trim rack for now. Um, it doesn't mean that I'm not going to buy next time though. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoy this and let me know your thoughts and comments down below and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.